Hey guys, welcome to a new episode of TFO OPT. Today we are going to try the hard difficulty of Tyrant's Ultra. Okay, as you can see, there is a full logo mm, of boss over there in the right up corner for the dungeon map. But actually, there is only one boss. Bathroom is real. The other three is fake. So basically, we need go. If we are we are lucky enough, where the first one we go, we can f find the boss. If we are not, we will spend. We will spend like extra. FP to get to get to the boss. Okay, one thing to watch out is the stone that is flying. If you stay right underneath the stone, you will like they will drop off and hit you. But don't worry, like it takes some time to, to get you and you can look at the shadow too. Oh. I hate this bad boy. Oh, that big guy hate him so much. But that's always like easy way. I think I explained how to pick him up in the spider kingdom. Um, and basically all you do is when he is hitting the ground with his big stick, you go behind him and beat him up. Yup. Look at that. How easy. Because he is gonna hit the ground three times no matter what. I usually go to the right because he can connect two boss room. The other two, if you go up or down, you only connect to one bathroom. So you go here, it's like a higher probability is going to on this side. It's like a half chance. First, I'm going to try go up. Okay, this is not the right one. I can tell because the real bathroom look come look really different. But anyway, we're gonna finish this room and we're gonna go to the other room. Go try the other rooms too. Uh huh. Okay, this one I call him the Iceman because he has the power of ice. And uh, after you, after you hit, kill him, you will get like increase of attacking speed and moving speed. Look at me moving so fast. And now we're going to try the room downstairs. Okay, this one is not the one either because I know uh, again I know how the bathroom the bathroom look like. Okay, this one I call him the grass man because he has the power of grass. And the sense he has really low HP and uh, um, defense, I finish him before he uses his power. Oh. Okay, now I'm trying the room down here. I hope I can get to the boss room. And I believe my luck is not that bad, okay?
Okay, great. Um, we are in the bathroom here. You, as you can see, the ground is broken, and you can see the lava under the ground. So here is clearly the bathroom. Okay, I just learned one thing is don't touch the boss on the first like 10 seconds because uh, the mob he summed uh, is gonna kill themselves and recover the boss health. Okay, when the boss is doing this, you need to jump. Okay, I didn't jump on the right time. Okay, when you see this boss is doing something like looks really dangerous, you need to jump. And you need to jump on the right time, okay? Okay, when he's doing this, he's not moving. You can beat him for a second and then you can jump. See, I, I did it. I, I jumped on the right time. Okay, finally I finished this boss, and uh, <clears throat> yeah, this uh, for this one it's all depend on your luck. If you're lucky enough, you'll save a lot of a lot of F FP, and if you're not, mm, bad for you. Okay, I guess it's time to say goodbye. Bye, guys. See you next time.